The White House announced an antiviral medication has shown real promise as a treatment for coronavirus patients. The FDA is now working as fast as it can to review data on the drug. The data shows that remdesivir has a clear-cut significant positive effect in diminishing the time to recover. Now, News 6 has learned Advent Health has been using the drug to treat COVID-19 patients. News 6's Lewis Bolden is live at Advent Health in Orange County with more on the treatment. Lewis. Well, Ginger, the first thing I need to tell you is the drug is still being tested and it's still in the early stages of testing. Medical experts say it does look promising, but there is still so much more to learn. It was a very quick onset. It got real for me when I when I laid down Sunday night and couldn't breathe. Drew McDonald's battle against COVID-19 had just landed him in the hospital when he was offered some hope. Doctors asked the 29-year-old to join a clinical trial of the antiviral drug remdesivir. I was already hooked up getting my, my medication for my double pneumonia, so I thought, why, you know, why not? Um, absolutely. By the time I left the hospital, I was already improving drastically. McDonald was one of more than 1,000 hospitalized COVID-19 patients in the nationwide trial. Those receiving remdesivir recovered 31% faster and were slightly less likely to die than those getting a placebo. Remdesivir, which was originally developed to treat Ebola, targets and works to block one of the enzymes that helps coronavirus multiply. It seems like it's a promising drug. I think that it's still early to say if this drug is the home run or not. Dr. Amai Parikh with Advent Health says they have treated seven patients using the drug, but says much more research needs to be done to know its effectiveness. I can tell you that six have been discharged home. One is currently recovering. However, again, whether or not this was due to the drug or whether they would have gotten better on their own, we can't glean that from our experience. Now, remdesivir has not been licensed or approved anywhere, and it has not yet been proven to be an effective treatment for COVID-19. Reporting live in Orange County, I'm Lewis Bolden, getting results, News 6.